Blocked by Bradley. He'll feed it calmly ahead for Bourbon. A chance for a two on one if they hurry. He has Neal on his right. Bourbon walking in, pulls it back, takes a shot, he scores! Riley Bourbon has the engineers on top, one nothing. It's a great play by the engineers. Just bring the puck back up the ice. Like you said, Bourbon a very patient, no hurry. Three on one. Jeff Taylor of the engineer of the Union Dutchman, excuse me, had. Gated the puck out all the way from his defensive zone into the tops of the far circles to take a shot. Gets caught, engineers break it out just about as fast as a glacier. Go down three on one. Easy short side goal for Riley Bergen there. A near giveaway at the side of the cage. Vinra gets back on it, loses an edge and goes down. Picked up by Melanson in the circle, feeding across. What a feed for Wilson. He scores! Wilson scores, it's 2 nothing. Jared Wilson, the freshman, coming down the near side wall. Nice pass out of the corner. I'm not exactly sure who it was, but... I think it was Melanson. Melanson passes it across. Wilson's there to collect from no angle whatsoever, just trying to get the puck back to the middle of the ice. Colin Stevens, I think, was just unlucky enough to have his stick out, ramped right up over his left shoulder and dribbled into the far side of the net. Yeah. That's why, that's why you teach goaltenders to have that stick square to the ice, because if you don't, it could ramp up just like it did. There was no angle for Wilson to shoot that puck. Somehow it found its way in. Nice Fulton right. in the corner, trying to dig it loose, spinning away from a check. Engineers work it back towards the point. Now Bourbonnet walking in, takes a shot, he scores! Bourbonnet left alone, and he makes it 3-0, his second of the game! Riley Bourbonnet stepping off the near side wall right across the faceoff dot. As an engineer, I'm not sure who it was, skates right across the crease front. Colin Stevens appealing to the official for an interference. I didn't see it too well, but uh, Bourbonnet steps off the wall. He's got Union Dutchman chasing each other around in circles, finds some space in the slot. Stevens couldn't see the shot. Power play time for the engineers. As they set things up, it's Neal back up top, Prapovesis. First power play game for the Engineers. Union's 0 for 2 so far. One timer, they score! Victor Liljegren makes it 4 0. The freshman from Sweden parking himself in front of the net. He usually spends most of the time on the power play, all a few seconds of it. He spent most of it with his back to Colin Stevens. Puck went down to the corner, as I believe it was Lou Nanny walked the puck behind the net. Wilsergren recognizes, steps off of the crease. He's about 10 feet out, opens up. Nobody between him and the net. Stevens left pretty defenseless, and Wilsergren just a quick release. Over to Fu, back to Vecchioni, far side hash marks. Now in the middle of the circle, gets it back. Vecchioni again, takes a slapper, and he scores. He snuck that one near post by Kasdorf. And it's a 4-1 to one game, a power play goal for the Dutchman. Yeah, Perry, I'm not sure if Amarato, the freshman, got a, uh, got a stick on that, but he was certainly in front with his uh, behind right in, the, right in the area of Jason Kasdorf, who did not have a good look at that shot, as I think it might have clipped his blocker or taken a tip from Amarato. I'm not sure. Perhaps the uh, refs got a better look and the scorers will tell us, but a great power play, great setup. Same if it's Vecchioni's, is his team leading fifth of the year as the engineers hit right back the way they score! I believe it's Fulton they surround Bourbonnet. I'm going to have to see that one again. Yeah, Perry, it was Bourbonnet drove the puck wide, I think, and gives the pass to Fulton, who has an easy tap in on the back door. The goal scorer was certainly right handed, so it couldn't have been Bourbonnet. But it's, I think he might have an assist. It certainly is an assist for Bormane. The goal for Fulton is his first of the year, third of his career. And the engineers get it right back, and I mean immediately back. It's 5-1. to one. Face off, pushed ahead by Miller. He'll carry on. Miller with speed. Walker in, it's actually Melanson. Suddenly pass, they score! off the feed from Melanson. You can see the speed right there from that freshman group. Wow! Yeah, Lou Nanny, the, uh, the freshman, picking up his third goal of the year. Coming off a two last weekend in the first game against Bentley. As the crowd, uh, the crowd shouts Lou all in unison. And uh, great faceoff win from Mark Miller. Pokes it forward. Melanson with a great amount of speed. Defenseman in the middle, J.C. Broussard, the freshman defenseman for the uh, 
for the Dutchman. Just a little lost. Lou Nanny finds a bit of space and makes it happen.